Hey all you, so if you're new here, welcome, and if you're a subscriber, welcome back. So today I'm going to be showing all you how I install the synthetic wig with no ball cap, like it's given scalp, period. If you guys want to see how I install this wig, keep watching. Go girl, go girl, Pam Richard, go girl, go girl. So I promise y'all this installation is exactly what I'm showing you. I did not do anything extra from what I'm showing you in this video. So keep watching. If you have any questions, comment below. a good pink and shears and cut that lace okay we are not using straight scissors in 2023 pink and shears please thank you you see that scalp scalp if you are new to this i recommend cutting this before you put it on your head so you can get like a chalk and outline it and then cut it don't do this if you're new because you might cut too much off i've been doing this for years so i know how much to cut So I do not let my glue turn completely clear before I put it on my head because for me, it did never work. So I put it when it's still white. Argue with your mama, not me, because I can still get a look that I want at the end. So keep watching, you can see. Okay, all right, so that is how I install this wig. It's easy peasy, lemon squeezy, nothing really to it. This is the Cloud9 um, Zelina in 613 by Sensational. I will also put the link in the description below if I want to purchase. But I did this wig before in this color and I knew she was like, ugh. French kiss 10 out of 10 so I had to cop her again with this is one of the most easiest wigs to install it doesn't take much the lace is pretty much like French kiss you don't have to bleach anything you don't have to pluck anything like you just install it and go 613 and my complexion I don't do baby hairs as I like to keep it like scalp and it's giving scalpy on it so I actually gotta go I will see you in the next video bye no